Are for Black Rasta Akasa Edi Afade ongoing Sako Die and Yvonne Nelson Saga Yihu. Now, I'm going to short video we Yeah, bah. Yeah, best one. the beans. I applaud Yvonne Nelson. You know why? If you must write a book about your life, you must tell it all or shut up for good and don't write anything. Was it that she lured Sako Die into a sex act? Number two, did she seduce Sako Die in her book? She said she got in contact with Sarko there. And they started talking. And then they got closer. And then they had that doggy style. In fact, Sarko there, he does not, does not even like missionary style. He likes doggy style. So the doggy style resulted in a pregnancy. She went with a friend called Karen. When they tested it, boom. It was locked. And when she called Sarko, the Sarko, they said, hmm. Incident BC, the opinion of industry players come to play because it can easily influence the way uh, you want to pass your judgment and even analyze the whole issue. Now, with regard to Yvonne Nelson, any sack or their pregnancy saga, chess black rasta. And in the side of reaction, Abba, we be a few sensible and deep questions concerning this whole saga. In any say uh, in Yvonne Nelson's book, uh, watch your uh, title near uh, I am not Yvonne Nelson, chapter 8, NHS, uh, or the some revelation on Sarko de Eba out say way back in 2010. Sarko de Eman saying I would deny responsibility thereby forcing her to abort that particular pregnancy. Now she confessed, say, uh, chess or no, and a force this whole vibe between herself and Sarko de Emma Eber resorted into pregnancy. Now in reaction, oh, Black Rasta Ebisa say, uh, chess, was it that Yvonne Nelson and a said, Do you see? Uh, because of his talent, a change you know into a sex toy, a very resort into the pregnancy. Question BMR Black Rasta beside and he say, uh, while making this revelation, you know, uh, did Yvonne Nelson consider said this thing could break Sarkodie's marital home? However, uh, Black Rasta was quick to applaud Yvonne Nelson, said, Booky or Troy, just uh, she made sure say every detail of the book was as it is in her life was also i applaud yvonne nelson for being bold to come out and then disclose say she has murdered an innocent child way among a lot of things and i black rasta they throw out emra now all hosting issue our three fm we can see your kind so on in the adrian and all the adrian share have a comment session am i yeah can also say Subscribe to Emma YouTube channel. Yeah, that's it. Next thing I want to look at, my brother, my sister, and I need you to come along with me. Is this thing about Sarkodie and Yvonne Nelson? I need you to come along and listen with rapt attention. How many of us have heard that Yvonne Nelson has released a book? And in the book, she alleges that she was impregnated by Sarkodie in 2010. And Sir Kodia at the time was living with his mother. And he could not afford to take care of a child. Therefore, Yvonne Nelson was asked to have an abortion. And she took the life of a baby so that she could make a man comfortable. Today, Sir Kodia is one of the biggest rappers in the country and even beyond. Today, my brother, my sister... After 13 years of an abortion of a child allegedly belonging to Sarkodie, Yvonne Nelson has decided to come out and spill the beans. I applaud Yvonne Nelson. You know why? If you must write a book about your life, you must tell it all or shut up for good and don't write anything. We were told that Yvonne Nelson was dating Sarkodie some time back. But many were those who brushed this thing. Because she was a silver screen goddess. Sarkodie at that time was only a struggling cocoon. Sarkodie at that time was struggling to be able to even get the microphone to spit his bars. We knew him from the start. My brother, my sister. Sarkodie at the end of it all 
was able to get his way. He had his way. When he asked Yvonne Nelson to have an abortion, that abortion was done. And today, Yvonne Nelson has decided to spill the beans. The beans have been spilled. Now, my brother, my sister, let's look deeper into this. Yvonne Nelson says in the book that had it been now, she would keep the child. But the child has been aborted. Today, the child would have been 13 years. Yvonne Nelson also goes on to say, her own father, Mr. Nelson, has never been in her life. In fact, she was actually rejected by her own father. She went ahead to also add that she didn't want to bring a child in the world whose father would also disown him. The same way her own father disowned her. Is this enough reason to abort and kill an innocent child? Forgive us, Father. Listen to this. Now, even Nelson, having said all this, said that had it been today, she would have gone ahead to have the child. What is Sarkodie saying? My brother, my sister, remember this is 13 years ago. People change. People see the light. Many shall be those who will be ready to throw stones. Cast the first stone if you are without sin. Imagine Sarkodie 13 years ago. Imagine Yvonne Nelson 13 years ago. And Yvonne Nelson said, their relationship was not nothing serious. But she just liked music. And she saw the talent and decided to gravitate towards Sarkodie. Was it that she lured Sarkodie into a sex act? Number two, did she seduce Sarkodie? In her book, she said she got in contact with Sarkodie. And they started talking. And then they got closer. And then they had that doggy style. In fact, Sarkodie, he does not, does not even like missionary style. He likes doggy style. So the doggy style resulted in a pregnancy. She went with a friend called Karen. When they tested it, boom! It was locked. And when she called Sarkodie, Sarkodie said, mm. said, huh? Auntie, please do something about it. What do you want me to do about it? She said, I bought it. My brother, my sister, how many of us are going to take lessons from this? How is Sarkodie's wife going to take this? Even Nelson has brought it up. Maybe she doesn't have too much to lose. After all, there's no man in her life. But we should also understand one thing. If Nelson has gone through hell, disowned by her father, had multiple sex with different people, she's gone through broken hearts. How many of us remember Inyanya of Nigeria? Look how she ab he abandoned Yvonne Nelson. And now she cried openly in the media. Today, many are those who might cast the stone. But if I were with her, I would embrace her and show her love and say that, listen, it's 13 years ago. Can we move on? This is a broken woman. There was a time we were told that she was even bleaching. She had to cry and say, no, I'm not bleaching. She's gone through a lot in the media. And the fact that her father disowned her. If you meet a man whose delicacy is doggy style. And you love the man. And it ends up in a pregnancy. Lord God have mercy. You might end up crying all day if Sarkodia had accepted the child he would have had a 13 year old child by now maybe he would have called this girl it would have been a girl he would have called her Ama Bonsu who knows Black Rasta and your ten in Kase, Wakasa, Eddie Afa, the ongoing Sarkodie, any Yvonne Nelson saga. A lot of people applauded him, say, just a question, so Bisaye, a very, very. Meanwhile, Sarkodie is yet to comment or react to this revelation made by Yvonne Nelson on him and his brand. Any update, a Bebano, yeah, the Bebrem, with him, Bass TV, so, and now we, yeah, that's it. Vimbaz TV.